So, Cape Town is at it again. The hashtag Cape Town is racist trended on Twitter last week. The Zuma Must Fall campaign, or someone who supports them, paid hundreds of thousands for an allegedly illegal billboard on the side of one of the city's most prominent buildings. Which was torn down a day later by angry ANC supporters. No cut when justice! We said it was illegal! That Mursa huge thing blocking the windows of all the people in the flat so they couldn't even see the banner for the canvas! Shame! How are they supposed to know Zuma must fall when they are in total darkness? So you support the Zuma must fall campaign? I support free speech, Justice. So oh you fucking big. Jamit Cape Town is a liberal and friendly city, but that doesn't mean we take cock from ANC vagrants who destroy our illegal and polarizing billboards. Remember, if you rend our billboards asunder, we have two billboards. Or in this case, several hundred. So what will the city allow? I suggest you know a more Cape Town styled campaign. Zuma must fall badges, beard weaves, and you know, white people dreadlocks, and patterns on your cappuccino foam, back tattoos in dead languages, and uh, of course, you know, the toddler t-shirts that turn your little snut-nosed brat into your own personal political billboard. You see? Who needs buildings? Or land? Oh, who needs the stupid campaign? I do, Deborah. Do you have any idea how many racist whites vote for me? 